Good evening, everybody. Uh, I just had my lecture, my speech in the Security Council urgent meeting on Gaza. It is almost one year since Israel is conducting its genocidal campaign against the Palestinian nation. More than 200,000 people have been mass murdered, wounded, or buried under the rubble. The entire Gaza Strip has been turned into ashes. The United Nations Security Council has done nothing to stop the carnage. Why? Because the United States and some other Western states have no regard for the lives of the people in our region and for the, and for the peace and stability in the Middle East. Israel has been so emboldened by, by, by the United States support that it is now turning against Lebanon. Just a few hours ago, when criminal Netanyahu was decrying lies and slander and threatening the whole region with more savagery at the United Nations General Assembly, Israel's military launched an unprecedented attack on a residential area in Beirut. Seven buildings were leveled level to the ground. They used several 5,000 pound bunker busters bombs gifted by the United States in a densely populated civil civilian part of Beirut. Unbelievable. As you noted in today's Netanyahu statement, the regime is desperate to set the entire region on fire. Today, many delegations walked out as criminal Netanyahu took the floor, but I think the whole world must stand up and stop this bloodthirsty monster that is no less a devil than Hitler. The West in particular, the West in particular, the United States and those European states that have long supported and, ena and enabled Israel must shoulder their responsibility. We do not doubt that the United States is complicit. Just see the amount of military and financial support flooding from the United States to Israel. In fact, Muslim people in Palestine and Lebanon are being slaughtered by American-made weapons. The Council, the Security Council, must act to stop Israel, and the International Court of and, inter, and the International Criminal Court must issue arrest warrants for him and for Netanyahu and his main circles. The United Nations credibility is at a stake and its authority is diminishing with its inability to stop aggression and atrocity of Israel in the region. We express our sympathy and solidarity with the people of Lebanon, the Islamic Republic of Iran, will be on the side of Lebanon and resistance by all means. And thank you very much.